coming upon the Kapok Tower, which we shall climb and look over into the woods. So this is a Kapok tree. And this is why they call it the Kapok Tower, seeing as it neighbors a park tree and it just goes up and up and up and up and eventually you get to the top of the K park tree. Oh my god, I hope my lungs can take it. top of the Kapok Tower. The view is incredible. You are literally in the treetops. And this is the Kapok tree, the top of it. Oh, look, we've got a few more steps, Stevie. <laughs> I'm good. And you're not quite at the top there yet. I'm good. No. Look, yeah, you ain't a worm today. To the top? Yeah. The view is even better from here because all the branches here well, cover everything go. around. If you go to the top, you can see even better. So, what do you want to do? Everything comes by from the city, by boat, by the side. Look at this. Oh my god. Look at all the way down there. Can you imagine? Oh. This is incredible. Did you hear that? Everything that is year-round yeah. needs such as property. Is what? Such as property. Oh, okay, yeah. Such property needs mm -hmm. quite a bit. Such almost all the houses have towers. So they all have towers. Yeah. And there's a, not, it's not a public tower, but if you pay 20, uh, if you pay, no, two dollars, you can go to the tower from the national park. Okay. Which is maybe, 20 minutes down the clay lick, and there you go. You pay two dollars. Let's go check out this last set of stairs, shall we? <laughs> Let's keep it zoomed out so you get the full effect. Now, if we were in the Andes at 10,000 feet, I would not be able to do any portion of this. But here, no big deal. Oh my God. Steve's being a pussy. He won't go to the left final step. Look at that. Look at that. No, we're not even there yet. No, we are. There's only one more flight. The top of the K-Buck. I'm king of the K-Pok! Oh my god. Look at the forest. Literally. Look at the forest below us. This is incredible. I mean, right now, a doobie would be really nice. Stevie, look up, Stevie. Don't look down, look up. There's a bird over there. Did you get the bird? Steve, there's birds everywhere. Not this high. Not this high. They don't come up this high. I want to see a sloth. They don't like K-Pok. 
The enormity of this Kapok tree is so impressive. I mean, this is just one limb reaching to the heavens. There's a second limb branching out. A third limb branching out. With a big limb of that limb branching out. And look below. You've got another limb going out that way. And if you look even further down there, that's yet another limb going all the way out. And then you have this limb that comes through the tower that goes out that way. And then this, I gather, would be the main limb that also goes up and out. It's absolutely spectacular, this tree. Oh my God, I'm in love. Absolutely spectacular. It is so beautiful. I wish everybody could experience this. And then of course you got flowers growing on top of the tree. Bromeliads, I guess. Carolina, the flowers up here, are those bromeliads? Really? I see some spiders, but they're not, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, not unfortunately. Nah, just the, the little wannabes. And how do these get up here? I mean, over time, is it just birds or animals that poop up here and... Yeah. Tree growing on a tree. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> this tree is so impressive. What else? We have some orchids, but now they are not blooming. But there are some orchids too. So what? What is happening? This tree has also more than 500 years old. Yeah. Wow. So there are many birds, mostly birds, that come here. They eat maybe some fruits and they relieve the seeds on the top. And also, um, with the part of the years, many, many years, 500 years, the wind also can help to disperse um, soil, also some plants, as you see, some exports from mushrooms, from ferns too. So that's the result of all of that process. Birds, and sometimes there are also frogs, I saw one time a poison frog, which is like this big, yeah, living up here, lizards, and all that animals, well, they prefer to live really high up, they stay here, they have also food, they have, they have even more water, more sunlight to grow up, yeah, so it's, it's an, an amazing place to live. How, so, they, how tall do you think this tree is? Uh, okay, for you. How tall do you think this tree is? The tree is um, maybe 35 or 40 meters. Because until here is 30, 35 meters. Until this flat. So a meter is three feet? Um, yes. 3.1. 3. 125 feet. 
That's all. It seems taller than that. Maybe because it's just so massive. It just seems higher than that. Let's call it 500. It's much more dramatic that way. So we're almost back to Sacha Lodge after our uh, Cape Pot Tower uh, afternoon, which was absolutely wonderful. And it is 6.30 at night here. We had a nice sunset. It's a beautiful sky. Absolutely lovely. And ahead is where the boats pull in. And that building is where we have breakfast and lunch and everything else behind it in the forest. Not the jungle, the forest. Swimming pool? Yeah, that's not so, yeah, that's true. That's where I go swimming over there. Caged in area. Anyway, lovely.